Okay, hello guys. Um, first of all, apologies that I didn't get this uploaded sooner. Uh, I've been working, so it's been quite difficult. Uh, in fact, I'm working tomorrow as well as working today. So this is kind of like um, a free bit of time that I've had. So I just wanted to record this now and uh, basically give you my thoughts on uh, the issue at hand. So I'm just going to get right into it. So basically, most of you will probably already know that DSP has in done something that in my opinion is the worst thing that he has ever done which is saying something for this guy and his track record so basically for those of you who don't know what what he has done on his patreon he has had a goal um for as far as i'm aware is pretty much as the whole time he's had patreon this has been his big his big goal for people to donate to um and that was that he was going to uh, make a reboot to Project 7. And obviously people, you know, out of all his goals, his goals are just shit, basically, his other goals. Well, all, you, do you know what I mean? They're very lazy goals, basically, in my opinion, what, he, what he's offering. So Project 7 is obviously the big attraction, the one that people, the one that gets people to open their wallets and say, that, you know, we really love this series. We want to see um, uh, Phil get back to it. And, uh, yeah, so Phil's been making money off this. I think it's like uh, $1,250 a month he's been getting. For people donating because they want to see Project 7, the reboot. And, you know, he's been putting it off, putting it off, putting it off. And basically what he said was, if I hit my goal, I will basically think about maybe taking off two streams one day to think about Project 7 and write like Project 7 and maybe have a teaser trailer to show you guys that I am working on it. So basically this guy values his time so much that he's telling you that for $1,200 he will maybe possibly take some time off to perhaps think about doing something that you want him to do. It's basically what he's saying. Anyway, this happened. He took... He got to the day he was supposed to take off the stream, uh, second stream, maybe both streams, I don't know. He ended up streaming. He ended up streaming Street Fighter and he was tweeting loads of things that, that sort of suggested that he had an announcement about Project 7 and it wasn't going to go down very well and blah, 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 blah. Next day, no, same day, um, he, he did a video saying what Project 7 was going to be and that it's now postponed indefinitely. Uh, so people have donated, given this money to him to have this happen, and all he had to do, the, the only goal, like, no one was expecting that he would be like, here's Project 7, it's finished, enjoy people. This day that he took off, he just needed to have something to show for it. A teaser trailer, you know, I'm sure people would have even accepted a video of him coming and going, okay guys, um, I've started writing what Project 7 is going to be, I haven't done a teaser trailer, but... I'll give you some notes on what it's going to be and some sort of time scale plan as to when I'm going to start it. No, postponed indefinitely. The guy took off um, a day. Well, suppose he was taken off a day. You paid him $1,250 to take a day off to maybe possibly think about doing something and he couldn't even do that. He just, he postponed the project because he couldn't put together like a two minute teaser trailer of him Basically saying Project 7's coming. It could have been fucking anything. Two minutes. He could have just sat on his fucking chair. Wouldn't even have to move. Pointed his camera at his fucking face. And just been there like going, oh, playing some shitty games. And then you could have Death Face just come up and go, oh, Phil, you're going to be playing this game. Ha 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 ha. And then Panda Lee could stick her head in and go, eh, do you want to buy some soap, Sweeney? And then bang. Project 7 coming soon. Done. Fucking. There you go. He could even have carried on streaming that day to get them first day views of us. Oh, Street Fighter, you got to get them views. All about them views. Like fucking... But no, nothing. He's postponed it indefinitely. Are you thinking, but Lutes, you say that people have given him $1,250 for several months so that he would do this. What kind of refund is he offering? Oh, I'm glad you asked. Because he's actually offering this very interesting scheme of fuck all. He is keeping your money. He has out and out stolen money from the Patreons to do nothing. He's done absolutely nothing. I'm going to show you a screen cap now. 
This is from his Patreon page. Patreons who donate $75 or more a month will be featured, if they desire to be, in a future creative project. This can be audio slash visual or both based on the script. Uh, update, it is certain if... It is uncertain if the Project 7 reboot will occur. Therefore, if you pledge this goal level, or have previously pledged it, you will have the opportunity to take place in upcoming Thanksgiving slash Christmas holiday specials. More details coming soon. So there, the thing that stands out, if you have previously pledged it, you will have an opportunity to take place in Thanksgiving slash Christmas special. Too late, but now, people have already give you that money because they want to be part of Project 7. You can't change shit now. You can't take the money for a filet mignon and then give them a fucking Big Mac. It's fucking stupid. You have taken their money. You uh, you say, oh, I've got a business degree. Do you? Do you have a business degree? Because it doesn't fucking seem like it. What you're doing is bad for your business of sitting on your fat ass and playing computer games. It's bad for business. Oh, customer's always right. No, not in banal land. You, you've, you've robbed people. And the, the fucked up thing about it is, you've robbed them, and because you have them so brainwashed, most of them, you're able to just be like, oh, oh, it's, these aren't the droids you're looking for. Oh, this is perfectly acceptable behaviour for bad news banal. And, and people are just fine with it. People are still donating to you. You've, you've offered something, took the money, and then went, actually, oh, I can't be asked to do that, guys. But I'll keep your money. <laughs> you fucking twat. Also, another screen cap for you guys. This is from the $30 goal. Shirts update. We have very few of the Project 7 Trio shirts left. However, I have every size from uh, small to extra large available in the Death Face design. And, hint, hint, Death Face will be a feature character in the upcoming Project 7 reboot. So it will be a far more um, pertinent shirt shortly. Hint, hint. Update that fucking thing, because you have just said that you're postponing it indefinitely, and you don't know shit about it, so how do you know Death Face is a permanent character? It's not even going to happen, is it? Let's be honest. You're not going to make Project 7. You've took the money, and you've changed the goal now. You've updated your other goal so that you know people know that it's not there, but you, you've still got this goal. This is misleading. This is fucking misleading. For anyone who hasn't got the memo, people could be pledging $30, and, you know, uh, for, for some sort of t-shirt for Project 7, you're mis-selling it. You should be like, buy this t-shirt from the fucking stagnant, probably going to be cancelled Project 7 series, which I might possibly maybe never get around to working because I'm fucking lazy. Maybe that would be a better description for you to put on there. Do you know what would be better? Actually, personally, if you, all these people that you've ripped off that really want to see Project 7, send those t-shirts out for free to them. Use that money that you ripped them off with to... Pay for poster packaging and go, I'm really sorry guys that Project 7 has been suspended indefinitely. But because you guys were passionate about Project 7 and I'm not a total cunt, which you obviously are because you're not doing this. Um, I will send these t-shirts out to you for free. So you're getting a little Project 7 something or whatever. You know, no. No, no, no. You don't get nothing. You might get to be on a Christmas special, Thanksgiving special that you didn't originally ask to be in. Oh, wow. Oh, thank you, Banal, for letting me be part of your, your fucking celebrity lifestyle and your fucking... Oh, oh God. Oh, DSP's let me be on his fucking Thanksgiving thing. Like, oh, people paid for a service for you. A service that isn't difficult for you to offer. A service that just requires your stupid, gouty, fat ass to sit down and just say, oh, Project 7, coming soon, which you have to take a day off for. And people have to pay you to take a day off. Fuck. Honestly. You, you're unbelievable. You play computer games for a fucking living. You play computer games for a fucking living. Easiest job ever. You claim you're stressed. Oh, guys, I'm, I'm really stressed. Because yeah, every morning I have to get up at, like, well, not even in the morning. I have to get up at 1pm every day, play computer games. Meh, meh, meh. I have to walk upstairs. Oh, woe is me. Poor fucking Phil. Having to play computer games. Having to fucking vlog about cheeseburgers. Having to vlog about... Hamsters and fucking fuck, fuck, fuck. You, you have no idea, do you? You need a fucking reality check. Your life is fucking easy. Stop fucking moaning about it. Stop begging for fucking money. You do not need money. For, for what you're doing is ridiculous. Sorry, th this, is, this is just beyond a joke. It's not just him, but it is the stupidity of people that are enabling him. I've said this over and over again. Why are people so fucking blind to this fat piece of shit? And I know that now I'm probably being all, oh, no need for you to make fun of his weight. I don't give a shit. He's a fucking con artist. He's a fucking con artist and he's ripped you guys off 
And you know what? You don't fucking care. You'll be on this video calling me a fucking faggot or some shit. Ooh, leave, leave Phil alone. Ooh, we can spend our money how we want. Yeah, you can. If you want to spend it moronically, then I guess it's up to you, innit? But fuck's sake. Are you really that stupid? He's already got it easy. Like I said, he moved house. He moved fucking house when his business was in a time of need. Got there. Like I've said time and time again, made it rain, bought fucking big TVs that you shouldn't be buying, bought fucking artwork that you didn't need, and then was like, guys, send me money, meh, meh, things are bad. Why did you move house? Why did you buy loads of shit? Why can't you take responsibility for your own life? You're a grown-ass fucking man. Why? You know, you're, you're making money off your ads anyway. If you weren't such a twat, maybe more people would watch your content, then you'd get be able to make money from YouTube. You know, I don't agree with the way you use Patreon. You're begging for money. You're begging for money. You're a guy that plays computer games in his house, in his office, and moans about, like, fucking, oh, guys, something really bad happened today. I had to walk upstairs to my office. Oh, the blinds aren't working. Oh, it's really hot in my office. Oh, my God, do you have any idea what a real problem is? Seriously, do you have any fucking idea? Need more money. Need to buy a camera. His, ne his latest goal is a camera. I think it's somewhere around 1600 He needs to buy a camera because his camera shuts off every 20 minutes. I think I spoke about this before. What the fuck? Why didn't you save your money? Oh, guys, it's really um, important to my business. Really? It's really important to your business. Your business that is very important. You know, the most important thing in your, your existence and your, the way you live your stupid lifestyle is your business. You've been on staycations. You buy fast food every fucking day. Do you know what I mean? Like, what about all these statues that you're fucking selling? Put that money to one side. Why do you have to beg people that actually go out and work a real job for your shit? What makes you so special? Are you really doing that good work? What I'm doing here is great. You're playing computer games and you're talking over them. Majority of your fucking commentary is, Yes, 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 or dicks, ass, shit. Like... Is that really good work? Oh, making people happy. Oh, you're a fucking idiot. You're a fucking con artist. And you're the, you are, like I keep saying, the, what is wrong with society today is, is you, in a nutshell. I didn't think you could sink any lower, man, but well done. Good job, Phil. Good job. You actually managed to sink lower than even I expected you to sink. You've actually stolen. And fair play to you, man. Fair play to you, because not only have you stole people, but you've Jedi mind tricked the fuck out of people, as if to say, oh, blah, blah, blah. everything's fine, you know, blah, blah, blah. and people are actually like, eh, I've never thought of it that way, Phil, thank you, keep taking our money. Fucking stop donating to the guy, man. He's just going to keep ripping you off. He gave you a goal that he knew you fucking morons would open your wallets for, and then he took it away because he can't be asked. He literally can't be asked. He stressed out because there are loads of games coming out. Oh, oh, I've been there, Phil. Oh, look at all the latest releases. Oh, God, stop releasing computer games. Fuck! Sick of it. Come home from my job, and do you know what I have to do? I come home from my job, and I'm like, oh, my God, look at all these computer games I've got. To I'm snowed under, man. Fucking snowed under with computer games. Oh, my God, Until Dawn's coming out in a couple of weeks. Fuck! I am so... I'm not prepared, man. God. Honest to God, man. Are you... Are you I'm actually, like, like fucking speechless at this stage. You're stressed because too many computer games are coming out. That's why you need to put off indefinitely Project 7, the thing that people paid for. This is why you're stealing from people. It's because you're stressed out. Sorry, Banal. So sorry that you're stressed, man. Oh, do you know what you should do? Do you know what you should do because you're stressed? Yeah, here's what I like to do when I'm stressed. I like to get up really late. And just spend a day playing computer games. You know, it really relaxes you. You know, you get up about one o'clock, play computer games for the whole day, and maybe get some fast food at... Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm describing my rest day, but that's actually a work day for you. I'm sorry. Oh, my God. I'm really sorry, Phil. Here's me being all insensitive and shit. God knows what a day relaxing for you is. Fucking hell. Honest to God. You, you have no idea. And I really hope that sometime in the near future... This whole thing fucking falls from under you and you just fucking are having to work a proper job. Uh, no one watches your fucking videos. Everyone wakes up to you and your YouTube channel will just consists of people going, Oh, remember when I used to be famous? Oh, but the fucking haters ruined me or some bullshit like that. Really hope you get what's coming to you, mate, because you fucking are overdue it now. Now you're stealing from people and that's scummy. And I don't care which way you spin it 
and the fact that you've got your 11 year old fanboys um, deluded enough that their mum's pocket money still gets put towards your fucking lifestyle you know it's hopefully that ends soon is all I can say you 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 make me sick man you, you fucking do and uh, yeah this is the worst thing you've ever done without a doubt without a doubt the, the fucking scummy man has like had his scummiest fucking um, hour ever uh, unbelievable absolutely unbelievable Right guys, I'm gonna end the video there. Um, there's there's so much more I, I want to say. Like as you can see, I'm really pissed off by this. Um, but yeah, like I said, this is very like um, uh, impromptu video. Like uh, I've not had much time to record. I literally just because this pissed me off so much, I wanted to get on camera. I've probably like rushed it, missed out a few things that I wanted to say. But uh, yeah, um, this Thursday coming up. Um, uh, I'm going to be on the Sons of Kojima podcast again uh, so I'll probably talk more about it there so check that out on the Sons of Kojima uh, YouTube channel or come along um, to their Hitbox channel uh, Follow me if you follow me on Twitter then you know I'll link it when I'm on there and stuff and uh, come and check it out um, they're an awesome bunch of guys we'll be talking about Project 7 I don't you know other stuff uh, so anything that I haven't thought of to say today I will probably say on there as always, guys, um, thank you very much uh, for you know your support and everything. Um, leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think. Blah 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 blah. blah. Uh, and yeah, um, couple. I know I say this every time. There are two videos that I'm working on, um, but you need to send me money before I finish them. Now, uh, a couple of videos I'm working on, and I just haven't got much time. I do have a week off work coming up soonish so hopefully i'll finish those two videos and upload until then as always thanks for your patience thank you very much and have a terrific day everybody